When you were a little girl, did you watch the Powerpuff Girls and go, yes, finally, representation of female heroines that can kick ass and aren't objectified. How the hell do they hold things? Or were you that little kid that thought, wow, I really wish there was an entire genre of music dedicated entirely to the drum beat from the theme song? Then you're just in luck because breakcore is that very genre. Breakcore, sometimes known as noisecore, is an evolved form of hardcore, jungle, and industrial music all mixed together like a giant bowl of EDM spaghetti. Really fucking fast spaghetti, like 180 beats per minute driving at illegal speed limit spaghetti. Very similar to its sister genre, Happy Hardcore, Breakcore is known for its oversampling of the break drum loop popularized by many songs. This loop is also known as the Amen Break, which has been featured in a bunch of songs since its inception in 1969, when the Washington DC based band, The Winstons, released the track Amen Brother. Funky. Fun fact. Neither the drummer G.C. Coleman or copyright owner of the track Richard L. Spencer get any royalties and think that any musical works with this drum fill is plagiarism. Even funner fact, G.C. Coleman died in 2006, so every time you hear this drum loop, it was played by a guy who died. Here are following lists of popular songs that have been known to use the Amen Break. Amy Winehouse, You Know I'm No Good. Linkin Park, Faint. N.W.A. Straight Outta Campton, Nas, Hip Hop Is Deed, Every single fucking square pusher song ever made. So if you want to recreate the almond break from scratch, the first thing you do is put a snare, and then put it on the second beat, and then put one like right here, and then one right here, and then I think one right here, and then you get the kick. Yes, that's a juicy kick. And then you put one like this, you put two, so it's boom, boom, ka. And then on this beat, you put them like that. And then you bring them back with the boom, boom, and then like that. And then you should have something that sounds like this. Now we need to add a ride to give it that extra flow. That's a pretty cool ride. And now you place that on every eighth beat, so it sounds like this. And then you make it faster, and then you make it faster, and faster, faster! <laughs> now if you're a lazy bastard like me, you can just get a like actual loop of it and just sample it and mess around with it. Like change the pitch, make it high pitch, make it low pitch, make it go from left to right, to left, to right, to left again. You can even chop it up and do your own things with it. Like, you can make it sound like this. Or you can make it sound like this. Or even like this. Or if you're really funky, you can reverse it. What I made is kind of an old school break chord track, so it's gonna have a lot of, you know, atmospheric elements and stuff like that. If you want, you can always add like, I, I don't know, hentai noises or fucking Japanese bitches saying stuff if you're into that sort of shit. So yeah, this is a atmospheric break core circa 1996 East Germany fucking Berlin Wall shit. I hope you enjoy.
Thank you so much for watching my video. I really can't do it without any of you guys commenting or subscribing or giving me suggestions. If you want to see how to make trap, click on this video. If you want to see how to make chill wave, click on this other video.